Hi, my name is Teacher Trapton, and today we're here at Outdoor School Bangkok, and we're going to do an experiment about lung capacity. Let's go. Lung capacity. Do you know how much air your lungs can hold? Make your own spirometer to find out. The results may surprise you. Materials needed are a 2 liter plastic bottle, water, a large bowl about halfway full of water, a bendable drinking straw, a permanent marker, and a measuring cup. The steps. Step 1. Fill up the bottle all the way with water. Step 2. Hold the top of your hand on top of the bottle and turn the bottle upside down into the bowl of the water. Once the top of the bottle is underneath the water, you may let go, being careful not to squeeze any of the water out of the bottle. Step 3. Push one end of the straw into the neck of the bottle and hold on to the other end of the water. Step 4. Mark the top where the air and the water meet with a black marker. Step 5. Take a deep breath and blow gently for as long as you can until all of the air is out of your lungs. Step 6. After all the air is out of your lungs, you can see where the water level is. Use a marker to mark that on the bottle. How much air did you blow into the bottle? Does this surprise you? Now try this. An average six-year-old lungs can hold about one liter of air, while an adult's lungs can hold four to six liters. Can you engineer an experiment that adults can do to find out how much air their lungs hold? Air is less dense than water. When you exhale through the straw into the bottle, the air pushes water out of the bottle as it moves to the top. The air moves out its identical volume of water, so you can measure how much air was in your lungs by calculating how much water was displaced from the bottle. Thanks for joining us for today's experiment. That sure was a lot of fun. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. See you again soon. Bye.